Hey, what's up, guys? So today we're talking about one inch exchange, and I'm very excited to announce that liquidity folio now fully supports the exchange. And uh, so I'm gonna walk you through uh, the ways you can track your ROI, get uh, charts of your liquidity provision with liquidity folio. Before doing that, I just want to give you a broad overview of the platform, uh, the one inch exchange UI, and see how you can use it, how you can provide liquidity. Um, so first off, I mean, one inch uh, started off as an aggregator. Uh, so as a DEX aggregator with multiple, um, you know, uh, decentralized exchanges, Uniswap and Curve and Balancer, um, but then also develop their own um, decentralized exchange. And that's essentially what we see here. Um, now, obviously, there are like different components as, uh, you know, as for Uniswap and other other exchanges, there is obviously a swap interface and then there is the uh, liquidity provision interface. Now, if you want to provide liquidity, you need to click here on the DAO. And then from here, you click on pools and you're gonna be able to see which pools you can provide liquidity to. And we're gonna uh, see in liquidity folio in a second where, you know, how can really uh, find the forecast of the yield for different pools. Um, uh, on top of providing liquidity, you can also farm the one inch um, uh, token. And essentially you can see here in the farming section, uh, the different farming opportunities to uh, essentially get uh, one inch token rewards. And again, we're gonna see in a second on uh, liquidity folio how you can uh, um you know how you can select the pools where you want to provide liquidity to so this is kind of their interface is brand new uh and i'm sure it's gonna still kind of change and, and evolve uh, as they go by the way some of you may be familiar with uh, the exchange called mooniswap and that was really kind of a v v0 v1 of a one inch exchange and now kind of this is the rebrand of Uni of mooniswap and uh yeah so so just uh, fyi now Let's go into liquidity folio. I really want to show you, uh, you know, the one inch integration and the way it works. So first off, if, if you haven't provided liquidity to one inch and you're still undecided where uh, to uh, to pool your liquidity, you can come here, you can go into the pool section, which is a kind of a catalog of all the liquidity uh, that you can uh, that you can use essentially. And you're gonna see here the different exchanges, right? Uniswap Curve Balancer, SushiSwap, and now you also see one inch. So you can click here, and essentially have a catalog of all the uh, different, uh, you know, liquidity opportunities, um, the different pools, right? So the most liquid is the Ethereum WBTC, uh, Ethereum USDC, USDT, and uh, basically for each of them, you see a couple of things. You see uh, the fees, right, o o o over the next 30 days. So the period to consider is that it's gonna be the next 30 days. You see the fees, you see the impermanent loss as uh, forecasted, as projected by the um, liquidity folio. And then you see here the uh, kind of the net uh, one inch ROI, which is the fees minus the impermanent loss, or let's say plus the impermanent loss, even if it's negative. And then plus on top of that, the um, liquidity mining so that you can see here in these other components. So just to explain, you're gonna have, for example, this pool, you have 0.29% in terms of fee, about 0%, maybe, you know, rounding uh, about zero um, in terms of impermanent loss, which bring us to 0.28%. And then there is the 2.34%, which is the liquidity mining of one inch rewards that you can get by staking your LP tokens in the one inch DAO, which bring us, you know, over the next 30 days, a 2.62% uh, ROI, which is on a net basis, on a yearly basis, a 31.9, which is about 32% uh, APR, APY, however you want to call it on a yearly basis. So this is the really the first stage where you can uh, yeah, really compare different pools. And by the way, you can also do this. You can say, oh, what about, you know, Ethereum WBTC on one inch? Uh, what if, you know, I would uh, I would, was to provide liquidity on the Ethereum WBTC on uh, on Balancer, you know, and you can compare different, uh, different yields on a, you know, like for like basis and make your decision. Once you um, set what once you're set in a pool and maybe you already provided liquidity, let me show you how you can really track your, the evolution of your investment. So you're gonna add your address as usual. You click here, you're gonna add your address. You click analyze ROI and you're gonna get the analysis. And then here, for example, you're gonna be able to see uh, if you have, for example, multiple uh, investments. So for example, in this address, there is some investment uh, on Uniswap, which is the pink component and some investment on the one inch, which is the red component, right? So you're gonna see it here. Then when you click, you're gonna be able to see uh, for, you know, in this case, there was uh, one inch and also Uniswap. So you're gonna be able to see uh, kind of these two uh, kind of tabs the, or the different tabs for the different protocols where you invested. But let's now focus on one inch 
So as usual, you're going to be able to see, um, well, here are a couple of charts, which is, we, you know, the evolution in terms of value of, of your portfolio pools on one inch. And uh, the dotted line is the, uh, you know, value if you held your assets outside of the exchange. The continuous line is the actual value of your liquidity in the pool. And here you can see how much, you know, yield, how much income you basically uh, take, you've been taking um, divided by the blue, which is the fees and the yellow, which is the liquidity mining, uh, which in this case is the uh, uh, is the one inch token uh, reward that is uh, this is minted um, as you stake your LP tokens. In this case, you can also zoom into the pool, which is an Ethereum WBTC. And uh, again, like for the pool, you're going to be able to see a kind of more detailed stats. You're going to be able to see all your investments, all your divestments, and as well as you know how the size of the pool, the assets that you own, uh, how much uh, you know of your LP token you staked. In this case, is 100%, and so on and so forth. So this is a quick introduction into uh, the integration for one inch. Uh, I, I really, um, you know, I, I was really impressed by the protocol as I integrated it. Again, this is started off as a Mooniswap uh, with some uh, really uh, new concepts around uh, the uh, the market making function. And uh, yeah, really excited uh, for, for you uh, guys to, to see it. And uh, as usual, if you have any question, feedback, uh, thoughts, please let me know. You're going to find my Contacts as usual here at the bottom of any every page of liquidityfolio.com. Uh, you can connect either via Telegram or uh, on Twitter. And uh, yeah, so feel free to do that. I'm excited to connect with you guys. Also, if you're a frequent user, you're going to see the invite to the private community on Telegram, which is small but very high quality. So I recommend uh, you guys joining. And uh, yeah, until next time, have a great day, guys. Talk soon.